Hello everyone, here with Martin Avid, part number two of the mod spotlight campaign for Pierce the Great. I can't say that this campaign is going too greatly. I really can't, but um, at the moment we are working towards uh, getting a stable economy. What I don't, I sort of have right now, but I have like five units left in my main army. Yeah, that ain't too good, is it? No, it ain't. But saying that, I can like join up with my other forces. And these guys are possibly going here, so I can kind of go outflank them. Um, but like these hoplites, they don't actually ha have uh, real. Uh, they don't have. They don't have an um, hoplite formation, unfortunately. It makes them a bit more vulnerable, of course. But I think we'll be okay. But this is going to be the formation. Um, the Lucanians, I think. Yeah, uh, I think these are the Lucanians or the I'm not sure what they were called. They are attacking me. One of the fa uh, faction is. Yeah, come over here. All right. Um, but uh, yeah, they're attacking the garrison. I thought, well, the balance bar is quite uneven. I think we can win this. And I think I'm right, because we are in an advantage in numbers here, I suppose. I'm not totally sure, because of course we don't have a full army. But like these, we have no... Oh, are, are these noble hoplites? Oh... Uh, yeah, these are like militia spearmen, not hoplites, unfortunately. These are light hoplites, but they don't actually have like a real uh, formation, so... And these guys are only here so we can go out flank them. That's the only reason why they're here. Uh, because they get, like they're already spreading out. They only have like four units here. If you can out flank them, you, you should be gone. Um, that's basically what we have to do here, basically. But like, if they want to go after these guys, that's also not matter. It doesn't matter if they want to go to those ones or those ones. It doesn't really matter as long as they go for. Or one of our columns, um, they will be outflanked, no matter what they will do. So that's basically the idea. And if we also can pepper them with some slinger fire along the way, is that a never too bad of a thing? But over here, I'm mostly worried about because they already yeah, they're sending their javelins Slingers. over here. That means the javelins are going to pamper. My ones, but these ones are the light hoplites, so they be Hot they should be a little ready. bit better than the light uh, militia spears. Like these are also like light spears, and all that kind of we stuff. Wait your command. So, Slingers. <coughs> all right, these guys, spears ready. come over here. At speed. Ready and waiting. Advance at speed. They're not even attacking them, are Just they? Nope. Are they actually losing decisively? A chance. We await your command. Oh. Slingers, draw weapons. Missile infantry. Head charge. Operators ready. Ready. Understood. Oh God. What? How on earth did they do break so quickly? Oh shit. Oh, this is going to be a difficult At one. At your service. Ah, bogus. Ah, shit. Whoa, what? My units are absolutely being slaughtered. Like these ones as well. Oh my god, I didn't expect this one bit. I thought it was going to be sort of holding the line, but... Uh, oh god. But no, 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 that is not going to be the case, is it? Holy shunts. Well, they broke before I could do anything. Like, that is a surprise. Although, 
Some of them are like also breaking over here, so... Ah, as long as we can do some damage, I suppose. That's also the idealistic idea here. Although, this entire flank is broken. They broke through faster than I had expected. Far faster. Your orders. Yeah, as long as we can do some damage, right? As long as we can do some damage, that Pyrrhus can take this back right off the bat. We await your command. Ready yourself. I don't care what you do, you're not going to win that anyway, so just try and kill him as much of these buys as possible. Like, I really don't. Just kill as much of them as possible. You as well. Perfect! Perfectly. Uh, we're not going to win it, but as long as we can do some good damage, sure. Fire, please stay there. Slingers at speed. Perfect, Missiles. perfect, perfect. Can't complain. Form up. Yes, Commander. Advance at speed. On your command. Quick march. <laughs> perfect! Absolutely perfect! Sometimes you can have some in the wind, right? Oh. Sometimes you can have some pro, uh, some extra... A little bit of extra abilities. Like that, that's perfect! Turn your backs, please turn your backs! Yours to command! Cop, throw them all. Come on, throw. Sure. At speed. Yeah, you'll go over here. Well, did this actually going better than I expected? Although, no, it is not going better than I expected, but it is going better than I expected the moment we were starting to lose all our infantry because they're not like attacking us so should although I possibly to a halt now let's hold the line like maybe they will go after them and then we can start shooting them in the back because this won't like kill them as quickly but some of them have like 100 kills that's quite good I would be happy if we would win this, but I don't think we will. I thought these were just normal hoplites, but uh, light hoplites, but they weren't, they were like normals. Oh, run, 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 run. I 
could win this why about actually just doing nothing and like waiting <laughs> i'm going to like sacrifice one of those units to go and try and do them out But not for, before I have attacked him. Perfect! Perfect again. Perfect. Perfect. Well, wait, wait. Hold. Oh, hold, you're fine. I'm going back here. Um. I now know, of course, these guys now are just so alone. Hold! Oh. Oh, Hold! You still got some left. I think I can break them if I get them a recharge. All right. Oh, maybe not. What? They didn't break. Okay. All right. Let's fall back here. Let's bring up these guys. Like these guys are like standing here perfectly, so I'm going to send them here. Right. Damage is the key here. Damage is the key here. Damage is the key here. Uh, more damage we can do, the better we're doing. These ones are confident still, but they won't. They won't be. Because these guys are going to shoot them uh, fully in the back. Well, I hope we can route them. Ha <laughs> ha! Perfect! Absolutely perfect. Yeah, it gives us some extra morale. <coughs> but we still got 160 Oblites left who I can't kill. No way that I can kill them. No chance. But, but, I think we have done a great job. We sort of slaughtered our entire army.
<laughs> now just give him a charge and see what happens. Bink! <laughs> well, <laughs> no. Well, a costly enemy victory. Um, we basically slaughtered and they have nothing left. <laughs> no, no. Chances in no diplomatic attitude here at Ardwin Simple. They got, like, they got no unit left. Only, only the general remains. Only the general. But I think I will push out right away with Pyrrhus. Like, Pyrrhus has no units left anymore after this. Uh, I just, re I just destroyed all of them, so I can have like an, a good income. That was my main reason behind it. Well, there's a payable Advance. army, luckily enough. Alright, let's push in. Uh, we're going to also have a rebellion, unfortunately. I must say, the campaign is uh, quite difficult because we have, like, we have like sort of a, a recruitment point system. Like you have a DI, but um, I haven't not been able to really recruit anything. As all the gods oh, look down yeah. on us, they too. Sure, I would not mind that. Uh, what are you going to do? <laughs> well, that doesn't matter too much. As long as we can... We no, take sure. this settlement! For real? Oh my god. You scumbags. You freaking scumbags. Ready for orders. We hunger for Damn it. Oh. Ah. Uh, that is quite a nasty one to do. Like, y you just can't see. The ra even the Hellenic Royal Guard, it's just not upgrading. Like, I have. N uh, it seems to be Rome is sort of consolidating their fights. They're winning from the Dimension, this Capital One, Lucania. Oh. Taras is actually helping out, but. I can tell you, it is a difficult campaign. It is just very difficult to handle the amount of units. Oh no, we're not war with those guys? Okay. Then I'm not going to attack, to attack them. Those on the doors. Ah. Alright. Hey, Carthage. Also a really strong faction. Not really in league with me, as you can see. Not too happy about it. I will send them over here. Um. Oh, not bad. Let's get some of those. Yeah, let's get some extra units. Oof. I can't tell you, this has been a difficult campaign so far, but I suppose that is a real experience mod, that is uh, sort of it. Our joint enemies would tremble if we were your allies. Your strength, our wisdom, together would achieve great things. Ah, why not? At least if you don't go and attack anybody that I wouldn't like too much
Oh my god, Syracuse. Why are you losing so many of your cities? That shouldn't be so happening that many. Often. Oh, yes. Give me those cheap units that I can get. Okay, one more turn. Nah, like they can they can beat that, right? Nah, no way. Ready for I don't believe they can beat that. Um, like they have so many units. I possibly will go as well with that army and then go attack them with two. Like they are still recruiting, so. Oh yes, give me a pike unit. I want more pikes. But I wouldn't reason the Brent's cannot replenish. Oh my god. Provincial reason, moral, land unit, unhappy population. Like, ugh. Like, I don't mind that right now. I have, to, I need that. Um, but like, when you actually have your armies in cities, it will decrease your public order. So that's good to know for the older of you that play this mod. Of course, in the description down below, you can see which mods I use. Uh, with the real uh, experience mod, I will. Um, have not put on all the mods that I will use in that um, sort of area. Uh, what I use is basically the entire collection. So those of you that were interested in that and which kind of things I use in that manner, uh, that is the case what I do. So. Ah, Bacchus. Um, should I just wait one more turn? I think I should. No, I shouldn't. Okay, great. Um, get out of there. On the move. In ten. Ah, nice. Hellenic disease going up, so that's good. Um, any mercenaries? No. I possibly should go back. Uh, I suppose we can still do that. Waiting for orders. Uh, there's some seed spears, not too diff not too expensive. Just some units that we can get. Okay, this is really important. Ready for orders. But the pikes are more important. They do stuff. Uh, let's just replenish those. Mm. A little bit more income. Like min 16. Ugh. Pretty harsh. Yeah. <coughs> but this is like. I suppose characters, it means how many units you have in your garrison, I suppose. Um, like, 15, 15 units means 15 characters, I suppose. I'm not sure I, I'm not sure how the game uh, yet totally works. Like, this also for me, like, experiencing mods and taking a look on it, so... Commander. But what I do know, like, I, I like the mod from what it is holding right now. I should ju Ah, oh, that's taking far too long, sorry. I At just can't command. do that, really. Ooh, perfect! Get me that hoplite. Oh my god, this client state is now actually getting. Ah, that is thinking me. Like, if I if I go to war with these guys, I'm already at war with these guys. Possibly, but I maybe should do is make them like my client state, like client state this entire area, and make sure that I can like recruit some really good units of these guys, because these guys also have some really decent units. So. That might actually make some sense, doesn't it? Toric hoplites, uh, Horus skirmishes. Yeah, we're working towards that. We can upgrade this. I think we should go for a go around and start building something, or maybe even food. But food, where were they building? So that That's should be fine. Command. This army is mostly contained of mercenaries, but getting some elephants in the battle will be also quite important but this guy is also recruiting units over here but it's really helping me out I really don't mind that yeah getting numbers in this battle is going to be important like we got a good economy but yes oh that is so good of you nicely done Taras you are getting a you're a really good client state so I might actually want to ask them for a peace treaty but if I oh no if you want Ooh, that they mo moved out against us. Rebellion imminent in Calabari. Yeah, that's this. Uh, that is this province. I will move towards them. I want hourly patrol. Commander. 
Ah, fuckers. Ah, oh, that is such an annoyance. Like, really? Because of the rating, right? Like, these Ipachian warriors are also quite good swordsmen. We Treasury is going to be empty. Mm. Of course. Like, I feel that they can, like, do far better recruitment than I can. Like, I can't even recruit, like, normal units. I, I don't know how that works, so... <laughs> if you have played the real-time strategy mod, please let me know. Ah, you bastards, of course, you go out right away. The moment I got my units out, right? Well, there's going to be battle I might lose, and Pyrrhus will die. Um... Yeah, let's go and uh, fight this. Ugh. Oh, I'll see you in the campaign map, in the battle map. There we are. Let's go and form up, shall we? Tarantine Cavalry! Uh, I, I can't just I can't use Pyrrhus. He like has twenty men left, so that ain't too smart, is it? Sticks. Okay then, there we got some of them. Slingers! Oh yep. By getting most of these guys out, it was going to be important. Most command. of them. Yeah, we can also do this type of thing. I've done this before. <laughs> Uh, like go to climb them there, like a At really nice defensive position. And it is actually, it is uh, quite quite ready. nice, to be honest. Okay, now let's start. I have not used everything because they don't have any cavalry, so at least I thought they didn't. No, they yeah they didn't. Oh my God, this guy's going to be so difficult to handle. But let's fast forward for a bit before we start getting complaints. Oh god, really? Okay, so we have to go this way. Yeah, because these ones are going going to get from this side of the angle. Scan them out. Okay, how's it going here?
Killing those ones off is also quite important. Fire upon their javelins. Heavy cavalry, ready and willing. Advance at speed. Missiles ready and waiting. Obliges ready. Oh my God! Why is that happening all the time? Right in the Oh yeah, of course, but all the units they can go to, they don't go to the units of the troops. Oh my god, why is that happening all the time? That's really annoying. Got Tarotines, now you have to go and push out. Steady! General is under attack. Yeah, there's no way of winning this, is there? Oh my god, oh yes, sure, our main line has broken. Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god, cavalry are so strong! Holy shit! Oh my jeez, that is an expe expected ally. Holy shit, those Tarantine cavalry, they command. won the day over this flank. General! For honor and glory! Yours to command! Archers! General! Riders advance! Quickly now! Huh. 
Missile infantry! Archers! Melee warriors! We await your command! Engage! Melee warriors! Holy shit, he's like holding off the entire unit. By your command! Advance at speed! Spears ready! Hoplites! Yours to command! To advance! Nice, okay, over here we haven't Royal Cavalry. necessarily won yet. Pack them down. The enemy general is dead. Ah, oh, perfect. Nice. Oh my god, it was a battle of the whales. Jesus. Continue. Oh my god, continue to fight me right away. Um. Alright, let's fast forward for a bit. Oh my god, I didn't thought we were going to win that, but those Tarantine Cavalry, holy shit, they ex absolutely won this flank. And that Hoplite holding out and the Archer being, being able to like pepper them at like point blank range. Like these guys have 300 and so much kills, that is insane. And some of these skirmishes did also quite well. So, yeah, that was a great, great day for us. Come up, Pyrrhus, you idiots. Well, the last one killed off. Not too bad. Well, let's enter battle there. A close to victory. Oh my god. <laughs> that was against two and a half, like the pike. Um, that was quite great, I suppose. Oh, yeah. Wait a second, sorry guys. Uh, yeah, yeah, there we are. Yes, okay, that's great. Any, we did a great job there. Yeah. I must say, the reels is. Um, it's the. What is it, the mod? Oh, yes, I def I just need that money. I just need the money. I'm very. Oh, I need the money. But right now we are in a position to move on. But we have to do that before uh, Tara arrives. Because if Tara arrives before we can do it, they can take all the man all that gold and I don't want that at all. Ready for orders. Commander Now they've got the rebellion then oh there. Yeah, I, I can't I can't wait. I can't wait for it. I really can't.
That's, in, that's an annoying part here. I just can't wait. Oh, uh, what? Really? Ah, shunts. Oh. Yeah, like he's in reinforced made of all of them, so we hunger for battle. And it sort of means I possibly should go for Ah, uh, they not close. Oh yeah, this is a difficult campaign. Jeez, man. Yeah, get me the food. I need more. F I need more food. Wait a second. Well, anyway, let's continue. Let's continue. Let's continue onward. All right, push on. Like we've got like eight more minutes, so we hopefully can kill off these guys in this episode. And next part, I will possibly try and just end it. I think I think that is going to be the idealistic ideal over here. Um, like go a bit around, don't do much. Like what the fuck, man? Why did you just not go after those ones? That is such a weird ideology. I don't know why you would do that. You should have just taken a victory over there. I got I also my allies in the south are dragging out those rebellious Lucania. How? Oh really? I'm just going to tax out those guys because it's not really big of a point instead. Like, why is the public order so bad? Characters, cultural differences mostly, and also slaves. Commander. Oh, oh, you. <laughs> no, I don't want. Okay, sure, my friends. Ready if you really orders. would want to do that, half goals. Like <laughs> oh, yep. Yeah. Oh, great. Oh, sure. All my good units are dead anyway, so it's not like Pyrrhus can die, so because he is an outer soul full, not outer soul. I'm going to elude him. Thing is, we didn't have got anywhere. They got at least this one anyway. Oh my god, no. uh, this one might actually be now be in a chance of being attacked. Oh god, let's do a quick quick march back. Shuryu will be there. I possibly should have maybe and gone and get some extra units. Do it this way then. Because we need to batter down those possible attacks of these guys that I might not be able to wear off on my own. But uh, what I will do for my allies is go after these guys or something like that. They would want to do that. That's an active attacking force. Well, at least we're in the good right now. Um, we got an entire province for ourselves now. That means we can also do an edict. Oh my god, wait a second. Oh, well, we got some really weird edicts. Like, <laughs> how many slaves do we got? Oh my, okay, I'm going to get that, like, get the thousand. I'm, I'm going to have rebellions every time, but I'm not going to care because we've got right now a rebellion. If I can get like a thousand increased income by slave, that is an insane amount. Like that is an insane amount. I'm just curious what will happen, but after this, oh, uh, in turn, we're possibly going to end it here today. Oh my god! Like, how is it that these guys will be able to do that? Because like, it's not, that's not fair. That is not fair. <laughs> I just ain't fair. One bit. Yeah! <sighs> like that ain't fair. Like I have one army that I can maybe so that's basically it. Oh really? 
Oh, not anymore. Sure. Oh my god, that is such a high amount of... Ready for orders. I can't keep these guys, it's not why. At least not all of them. Could rather like recruit one more, it's more worth it. Yeah, uh, 12, 14, got some units, but not really all full up, so... To victory! I'm going to take, let's see if I can kill. Yeah, I fought something up. You bastards. Oh, they knew, they knew it. Alright, uh, with that we got conquered the uh, total province of Calabria, like, if you would, like, buildy, buildings, happiness, min 30. Province instability, min 20. Cultural differences, characters, cultural differences, here as well. We got a bloody invading army. That has one settlement, but is able to do that. Like, I am not sure what that wants to mean. But if that is going to be a mod like this, I'm already going to be suspecting that this is not, not my campaign. I am not in a fan of this kind of crap. I'm really not. But most of these guys are all shitty, so maybe it is valid. It's valid. Like, the, if you got 2,000. Like, that means 20. Like, 10 is like 200. It's 400. Okay, 10 is 400. A bit more. So, yeah, 400. Like, in total arms, 800. Another 8. And another. That's 800. But then, like, the mercenary payers are still less in the upkeep cost. So in theory they have like an army that like these guys have an army of total they did this army costs around a thousand, eight hundred and eight hundred. That's around to, that's that's two and a half stilgen and they they have lounged around that and they got this one extra, that's also two hundred. So they actually have enough to pay for this. It makes actually unfortunately enough sense. It is actually valid. They just have a ton of crappy units, and we don't have a ton of crappy units, we have really good units. Although Saying that, they are actually quite strong. Saying that, yeah, they're actually quite strong. Oh my god, like, look at that. Like, that's growth reduction, uh, wealth from commerce, commercial child and slaves, replenishment, really shitty. Um, this one is not good at all. Yeah, taxes plus 15, 20 minutes from taxes, jeebus. Like, Holy shanters. And this one is probably worth it, but because right now we have a rebellion, but after that I possibly have to do like this one. I'm not sure how much growth we got in the province as a whole. Like eighth growth rate. So the other one that we could do. That's one of the ones. But these ones as well, like like that 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 is still quite a lot of uh, units that you have to well pay for. Well anyway. That was part two of the uh, Paris the Great campaign. It is uh, quite a hard campaign, as you have maybe seen. Taras was a really great powerhouse, but now it is reduced to one city state, to one city, and just a blink of an eye. And a bit of an unfortunate tether. You got like a few more of those ones left, but they should not be too big of a deal. I'm just hoping, like th these guys, like, are really happy with me for some reason. Welcome, and let us be honored by your attendance and your work. Join war against a war. No, okay, sure. Well, anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. If you want to play this mod for yourself, don't forget to have a look in the description down below. 
there you can have all the links to all the mods that I use in this campaign next week of course there will be a new campaign if you want um, to see a certain overall mod don't forget to put them in the description I will also consider them and sometimes I will actually do them so don't forget to put some of your own ideas or yeah overall mods in the comments thank you all for watching and I see you all in the next one bye bye